Chagas disease, also known as American trypanosomiasis, is a potentially life-threatening illness caused by a group of parasites called Trypanosoma cruzi, or T. cruzi for short. It's estimated that about 6 to 7 million people in the world are infected by this parasite. Although it occurs principally in the continental part of Latin America, in the past decades it's been increasingly detected in the United States of America, Canada, many countries in Europe and some countries in the Western Pacific. If left untreated, Chagas can cause irreversible damage to the heart and other vital organs. The most common way that people are infected is through the blood-sucking triatomine bugs, also known as kissing bugs. The bugs live in crevices of walls and roofs of houses that are made of materials such as mud, straw and palm thatch. They come out at night to feed on people's blood while they're sleeping. Once they bite, they defecate on the person's skin. Their feces contains the parasite, which can then get into the person's body through the bite site, through mucous membranes or through breaks in the skin. The infection can also be transmitted from mother to child during pregnancy through contaminated food and beverages, blood transfusions or organ transplants. There are two main stages of the disease, an acute phase and a chronic phase. In the acute phase, which lasts about two months, symptoms generally start to develop about one to two weeks following the bite. These are generally mild and non-specific and may include fever, fatigue, body aches, headache, rash, loss of appetite, diarrhea and vomiting. In the chronic phase, about 70 to 80% of people may not show any symptoms at all. However, in about 20 to 30% of people, the disease progresses, mainly affecting the heart or gastrointestinal organs. This occurs 15 to 30 years after the initial infection. The disease causes scarring in the heart, which can lead to heart failure, stroke and arrhythmia. In the gastrointestinal system, there can be enlargement of the colon or the esophagus, leading to digestive problems. Currently, only 1 in 10 people with Chagas disease are diagnosed, and only a small percentage receive treatment. With an estimated 75 million individuals at risk of infection, it remains a profound public health issue, with significant social and economic burdens in Latin America, and increasingly on a global scale. The World Heart Federation and the Inter-American Society of Cardiology Roadmap for Chagas Disease is a key reference document for anyone involved in the planning, organization, patient management and implementation of approaches to Chagas disease. It outlines a vision of an ideal pathway of care, potential roadblocks along this pathway and evidence-informed solutions for healthcare professionals, health authorities and governments to overcome these roadblocks. Drawing on the expertise of clinicians, researchers, allied health professionals and health systems experts from around the world, it presents an integrated approach to patient care. The World Heart Federation is supporting the global implementation of this roadmap through our national roundtables, CVD scorecards, the Emerging Leaders Programme and World Heart Day.